Hey everybody, I'm APH, and a warm welcome back to Anno 1800, as in the last episode, we fixed all the problems from the previous episode. Now, we are currently in the town of Mears, where we have a little bit more upgrading to go, in, and we're in the middle of a beer festival, apparently, to actually get this fully transitioned into workers, where we got a little bit of a, a farmer land here, a little bit of a, a worker land here. Let's see what we can upgrade now before we head over to our new island as we're starting to bring people over here I think it's proper that we actually give this a real name so let's go ahead and upgrade these this will be where the actual artisans are and this will be where the workers are over here but I was thinking the name that we're going to go ahead and name them is Charlevoix there we go and now this is a proper town. And one of the first things that we're going to need over here is it looks like we're starting to cap out on resources. So we're going to need a couple of depots. So we're going to need some bricks as well as some actual lumber. Place these down. Yeah, let's go ahead and place yeah, two of them right here in the harbor way. Get those built so that we can actually uh, build and maintain. And then it looks like we've got steel and brick but we could actually use another load of wood. So let's go ahead and send our flagship down to Archibald to grab some more. Sales. Well, we just kind of get going. Let's see. Police department to set us back a little bit. 50, uh, 10 bricks and uh, 10 wood. And the Oh, hey, that's a problem. We're only supposed to have one police department. One of these is supposed to be a school. Let's fix that. Talent won't <laughs> without discipline. Admiral's not liking something. Now, this is an easy fix. We'll go ahead and move these guys over so we can get rid of this road. That will take care of this issue. There we go. And we can probably upgrade some of these. Excellent. That puts us up to 130 workers, which allows us to actually drop down our brickyard. <laughs> Still locked by the fact that we don't have any wood, but that will be taken care of shortly. Speaking of Carl, a uh, a quest just popped up for him. Let's go ahead and take a look and see what he's offering. Competitors are now at war. Ooh, an admiral and uh. Oh boy, Willie, are at war. Let's go ahead and see what he's got. See how magnanimous I am. <laughs> giving you work. Magnanimous giving me work? It's oh. an honor to serve upon my ship. That's some timber and steel. That's not uh, not difficult at all. Let's go ahead and grab this wood with our flagship. Good. Now let's go ahead and trade that over. See if he's got any good items. Nah, nothing good in there. I don't have enough money to just randomly roll, but we'll go ahead and send these guys up here. And then we'll go ahead and loop back and grab the the steel. You know what, actually, what we can do is we can probably make another clipper, a little spooner over here. I can't wait to get into frigates, man. We might get, we'll get, we'll definitely get frigates. We might get into clippers this episode. So let's check our paper. Ah, uh, mission successful, a non-aggression pack, and... A ceasefire, just to kind of give us some extra bonuses there. We'll take those and go ahead and publish them. Liking that, liking that. Let's grab our our, our spooner, and let's go ahead and slow down speed a little bit as we go ahead and grab uh, Carl all of his goods from over here. Now, taking a quick gander through here, it looks like... Yeah, everything looks like it's set up correctly. Let's get another a depot over here as well. I got a feeling that as we're starting to move stuff over, it's going to get really effective. Yeah, just we'll throw two of those in there. Now, let's go ahead and get this traded over. Yeah, 15 lumber. We'll go... There we go. And six steel. I believe that's an intermediary. We have none. Well, that's a problem. Go ahead and shut down the actual uh, the the beam factory just for long enough to get that going. 
I'm a little bit surprised there. Wonder if we have any in our, our other town. I know we had some kind of stockpiled over there. Yeah, we can do that. We can go ahead and grab it and go from this one. That way we can keep our steel factory going. Then hopefully we'll get a stockpile of actual beams over here so we can shut that down. Excellent. Let's go see if we've got any more wood over here. Yeah, there you now we're kind of cooking. Let's go ahead and get this next run of of workers and see if we can upgrade some of these. Yeah, we still have to get a little bit further so that we unlock the school before we actually can get these upgraded. And I know we've got a school over here and a, a police department. The school still needs just wood, so we're good. And it looks like we're starting to actually bring steel over from the other land. Let's go ahead and upgrade our brickyard. Now, how close is our, our flagship? Yep, let's go ahead and speed up time a little bit. And it looks like our spooner's just about to get here. I'm thinking sometime this episode, we're going to have to bring in some more wheat. Yeah, let's be proactive and let's go ahead and upgrade the ones that aren't built. Looks like this one still needs to be upgraded too. Kind of keep, try to keep ahead of it because I got a feeling bread's going to be a necessity. All right, six more of the steel. Yeah, only six. Let's get you over to his, uh, his little ship there. Ah, now the flagship has arrived. Hit, still on one. Let's try to transfer it all over. That's much better. Let's get our school first, and we'll get our chapel. We're missing bricks for the chapel. Could learn from the discipline of small ah, he's liking something. I gotta tell you. Give it here. Uh, ooh, and there's our quest. Good. That's good. Now scurry back to the sewer. <laughs> scurry back to the sewer, man. You don't know who you're talking to. If they have time to mope, they have time to Looking at the Admiral, he's getting pretty scary. He's got engineers already, so we got to play some, some catch-up in this episode, that's for sure. So I want to get this uh, these guys upgraded as soon as possible, and we'll just kind of do them in batches. It looks like we're missing bread and we're missing our our soap for some reason. Let's go ahead and check back over on Heart and Heart Mirrors and see what's going on. Now, our pig production. Yeah, let's go ahead and upgrade this one and see how that actually affects it. Looks like all islands, that puts us at uh, positive. We should probably get this one built as well, because I have a feeling we're going to use it. Let's go ahead and grab those two and get one more, and let's upgrade that. That should take care of our actual needs for soap. While we're over here, let's take a look at our sausage need. Yeah, it's starting to fall behind there, too, so we'll do the same with this. We'll go ahead and just upgrade that, get those. Ooh, no promotion available. We're missing brick. Now, I know that we actually set up our our bricks to be over uh, overdone, but I don't think that we have enough bricks yet. Enough brick production, that is. Maybe we need to stop sending it over to the new island now that we've got a brick production over there. Let's see what our limit is. 50. Let's go ahead and set this to 100 now that we've got bricks over there. Yeah, that's probably a good decision. Let's make sure the rest of them are all set up right. It looks like bread and the actual soap are set up right. Sausages, man, that is really low. We might actually get into trouble from that. Now, as for this little section, let's see how the bread is looking across the two aisles. So we're still good on bread. I want to hold out as long as I can on upgrading that. Now, do we have enough to actually build these two? Alright, that should give us a chance to actually get caught up. And we can go ahead and throw the rest of our our wood in there. Oh, still no space. Now, yeah, that's, that's okay. We can probably upgrade something. Yeah, that's that's pretty beautiful there. Let's now we can throw our wood in there. Let's go get another load of bricks from old Archibald. 
He's got a quest for us, but I'm not sure I actually want to take that quite yet. I'm liking this. Uh, let's go ahead and get our chapel built, and can we get our police department built? Now, it looks like bread has made its way over here, but we're still missing the actual uh, soap. So only one more, and then we can go ahead and get in there. Now, when we do hit the actual artisans, the first couple things that we're going to do is start making glass so that we can get into the production of the Docklands. Because I, I foresee that this island is going to be big enough that we're going to have just a constant stream of ships over here at first. So this is kind of the the go-to, is getting these guys up so that we can get that kind of started. Now, do, does one of my ships actually have soap on it? Yeah, yeah, this this ship's got soap, so we'll be momentarily... Uh, let's see what's in the new paper. Uh, low risk of explosion. Good. Happiness and light, which is good. And financial powerhouse. We'll take it. We'll take it. Let's go ahead and get that police department and the church down. And it doesn't look like that's there yet, but let's go ahead and take a look. It looks like our flagship has arrived. So let's go ahead and get... Uh, we'll get 50 steel and the bricks, and let's take a look and see if anything's in them over here. Uh, we'll roll it once. Yeah, we should probably take that sail, but I'm not quite sure. Let's go ahead and roll it one more time. Now, the bulwark makes it slower, but that actually could actually help. Fine wooden hull. I guess it's the next level up, the blue one, that's the bulwark. Yep, yeah, let's go ahead and send him back. Yeah, that will be the bricks that we need. Still light on bread. Let's just make sure that it we didn't go over the actual limit. A competitor raised a settlement. Ooh, and somebody just grabbed something. Right on the edge. Now, it looks like actual flour is good, so let's go ahead and upgrade the next actual bread production so that we can get this moving. Yeah, another bakery. Let me make sure that I was looking at that right. For some reason, my brain's telling me, yeah, yep, that's 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 what we needed. My brain was telling me that, uh, oh, I am looking at it backwards. Our supply is actually too low. See, this is why we look at things twice sometimes. Let's go ahead and get our next flower. And let's go ahead and see where these guys settled. Man, in the last episode, I said we needed that for abundance. And look, Carl took this one, and the Admiral, he took this one right here down to the south. Not really too useful, but I mean, we could have came down here for like a hot farm or a potato farm in the future. Now, I have a feeling we're going to actually, and at some point in time, take out the Admiral for his island, because I like him, I like Willie better than him. Speaking of the Admiral, let's grab this quest. A mission of great tactical import. Ah, just a little pickup quest while our flagship is moving. We could probably just grab it with one of these little spooners. We'll get them sent over, and let's see where our flagship actually is. Yeah, there we go. Right about to get there on time. And then it looks like we're starting to actually uh, cap out again. Let's get our dock upgraded. That'll help out quite a bit. All right, all you guys on to shore. Now we we're looking a little bit better. Do we have everything still missing sausage? Okay. Come on, guys. You you gotta be getting close here. Yeah, we gotta be getting close because we're we're overproducing. Let's go ahead and get this one and these two. Now we we probably have a ship somewhere on one of the trade routes bringing it. Let's see. Beer, soap, fish, bread, flour, sausage. You're going the wrong way, man. Did you just drop off? Oh, they did, and we're already almost out. Yeah, we're not picking up, up enough of that. Looks like bread's just barely hanging on. Ooh. Ooh. Might be able to squeeze it. Oh, we just missed it. It'll be back in a second, and then we'll get them upgraded. 
Now let's take a look at our, uh, our old spooner there. Grab this for the Admiral and get him sent over. Looks like our people have a quest. This is going to be a worker quest. This is probably like a riot or a find a kid at a schoolyard. Your magic for us. What we do so love to see. Yeah, we do love the magic. And... Sausage and bread. Sausage and bread. Yep, we've got it. So that should just instantly... And we get a ship toolkit. You know, I was just talking about wanting something for my ship, but I'm not quite sure that's what we're looking for. And the flagship has arrived. Let's go ahead and send him back down to Archibald. That should get going. Now, do we have sausage yet? I think he was somewhere down in here. Yeah. He's... Oh, right as he got close there. All right, Admiral, yeah, turn in. I am no minion. Let's get those upgraded, and now... Just a little bit more, and we can go ahead and upgrade this row. Looks like it takes brick, steel, and wood to do the upgrade. Just waiting for that just to kick over that last little tick. We should see arrows starting to come up. Yeah, there it goes. It's 100%, so we're just... There they all come. My folks were farmers. Stink of manure or stink of grease makes no odds, as long as you're paid. Now, for some reason, A new milestone. this one is out of the range of the school. Ah, Doc Lins pulls the world into a new era. The op uh, the channel to the Land Alliance has opened. Now, boy, Tobias, we got the Land Alliance. Or we've got that. We don't need it. What is this? I'm missing a road right here. You reached a new mile. And one right here. Let's bring a road kind of down this way and a road here. See if we can actually get that need for school extended all the way over to him. Uh, we're not ready for that. And let's see what our actual residence quest is. As soon as it activates. From this bright moon, I am yet greedy for starlight. Offers a a photography quest. It looks like take a, a picture of the school. Yeah, we'll get it from this angle. Ah, uh, very nice, very nice. I wish when we took the picture of the school, it didn't show all the blueprints, that's for sure. Let's go ahead and submit that. Rapture. Rejuvenation. And it looks like we actually got some some actual, like, little blueprints for some decorations. Good. Now, we can probably build some better ships now. So let's take a look at our actual shipyard. And it looks like the frigate opened up. And we need a few more for the actual clipper. Now, I will take a couple of frigates just to kind of monitor the water. And I'll go ahead and get our next batch kind of queued up because that, well, we need them. Now, let's take a look at the actual need. It looks like canned food, which I'm not too interested in doing right away. And sewing machines just opened up. Let's go ahead and take a look at those. Now, they're going to take windows, and we'll get that going first, because we'd like to get into Docklands. And the route that we're going to take is, it's one to one to, to two. So we'll go ahead and get our, we'll put this in blueprint mode to kind of do this. We'll put our, our actual window maker there. And we'll go something about like this. Yeah. And we're going to want two of them. And I know this isn't the most efficient. We'll take care of that later, guys. Right now, I just want windows in production so that we can actually get going. Because we're going to need a lot of windows. And then the last part of that is we'll need down here on the water. We'll need the actual sand mine. Oh, let's go ahead and close out of that menu. Yeah, we'll go for two. Let's actually take a look and make sure we have enough workers and enough artisans because... 
We only have 500. Oh, I can't put it there because of the... I put the, the warehouses there. Yeah, we'll put it over to the edge. We might have to... We can probably move around these a little bit to kind of... Yeah, we'll, we'll put it on the outside so that we can... Uh, uh, move this in closer. So these take 25 workers, which is not a problem. We'll go ahead and upgrade both of those. Now the window makers, let's get the warehouses down first. We should probably upgrade them all the way. The glass maker takes 100 artisans. And each one of the window makers takes 100. How does that let it leave us? We still need a little bit of bricks. I think we sent old our, uh, our flagship down. So let's see if we can actually get another you load of I bricks to get going. Time hurts you. Yeah, that's good. And uh, let's go ahead and grab some, some wood to go with it with the bricks. And let's see what's over here. I kind of want that high power score. But part of me is like, no, leave it. Nothing really in here. Let's go ahead and spin it one more time. Yeah, no. All right. There we go. We'll take this one. Make our ship a little bit more beefy in case we do get in a fight. And let's go ahead and send him back over. There's my ship constructed. Hey, our first frigate is done. And it looks like Carl has another quest for me. Let's go ahead and get these guys upgraded. And let's go see what Carl's quest is while we're... I uh, grabbing our frigate. Something even you can handle. Uh, just a little bit of a, a destruction quest there. So let's grab our frigate and keep me waiting. it's destroying a frigate. All right. All right. We'll see how they handle one on one. Hopefully ours is a little bit better. Maybe I'll grab our our actual flagship and send it over as well. Let's go ahead. And... There's the frigate. Oh, I think it's going to go towards our harbor. Which if it does, it's going to be toast. Oh, there's the, the channel. Well, it's going to be a little bit for everything to actually catch up with it. Now, is my diplomacy? No, I was worried that my, my ceasefire ended. Yeah, it's still following. Check copy. All right, let's see what's in the paper. Ah, renovations boost city appeal. We'll take that. Competitor settle island. Yeah, we'll we'll claim those back. And uh, benevolent leader, uh, leader secedes again. We'll take it. I don't want to use too much of our actual influence. Oh, there we go. Ship All right, you, Mister Flagship, go on over here. And as for our frigate. I want to go ahead and grab our actual thing. It looks like our other frigate's over here as well. Oh, maybe our other frigate. Maybe I accidentally uh, set the waypoint somewhere. Set our way waypoint right there. Kind of keep that in the, the right neighborhood. And a royal letter. Yeah, we'll take it. Let's go ahead and send him over to the uh, Carl, and it looks like we have a quest to kill two frigates now. Admiral likes that we're working our people hard, but I mean, we kind of have to at this point in time. We make the best of what we have. Now, they require this market and this market. Soon enough, we'll be able to take this market out of here, but not quite. Good, and it looks like we can go ahead and Bring those up to date. Looks like we might just be missing just a touch of wood. Ah, and there's the, the quest for the Kate. I'm suddenly hot under the collar. Hot under the collar? You can do that at your age? Alright. Looking a lot better. That should unlock clippers. That should be the actual thing we're looking for. Yeah. Now clippers can get going, and we're going to go ahead and queue up as many of those as we can, as well as we'll go ahead and queue up a ship of the line. We're going to start pre pre preparing. Wow, if I could get it out of my mouth. 
we're going to start preparing for war so that we can take over one of the islands of ceasefire has ended and there's a ceasefire uh, but we're going to get ready to actually take over one of the admiral's islands just because i really i really want that island i really want this island i think this will be a good investor island so it means we're going to have to get looking at his actual harbor here probably probably a dozen or so ship the lines and just kind of zerg it all at once and I know he's got something back here too, but it looks like he's at war with Carl. Oh, he's at war with um. A competitor's <laughs> island is under siege. He's at war with uh Willie, and Willie just sent like a one-man crew over here. You go, Willie, destroy his uh oil harbor. No better way, right? Just a little gunboat being like, hey, hey, what you got on me? Um, let's go ahead and check on these uh frigates. Uh. Why didn't you turn in? Yeah, let's go ahead and pull that over there so that it can finish, and then we can send our two frigates. There we go. Let's go ahead and offload all of these into our warehouse, not the actual bulwark there. We'll keep that. Good. This area is starting to look good. We'll go ahead and upgrade Ship under these attack. guys. Now, I'm fairly happy with this right now. Let's go ahead and take a look at the frigates. Make sure they're not getting hammered on. Good. Ready? Looks like there's one more to go. Let's go ahead and get our flagship over there to help them. And once that's done, then we'll start building the actual... Uh, We'll start with the sewing machine factory just because it's more efficient than the the cannery. And then what we're going to do is we're going to take a look at Eli and see if we can kind of do the spin to win for something like this. You know, that that's pretty huge. You know, affects potato farms and hop farms and you get extra snaps. There's one for the actual cannery that makes it so instead of um, goulash, you can do it with uh, just flat out pigs. And that's that's a win win. Oh, man, take that frigate out before that ship dies. Come on. Talk about nickel and dime in it. Let's grab that and get it turned into the actual over to Archibald. We'll send both of them down here just to kind of keep them together. Now. Got a little bit of glass now. And we can start with our, our actual sewing machine factory. So let's take a look at that chain. Now, it looks like the iron mine and coal mine now. Let's go ahead and get those down before I forget about them. Yeah, there's the iron mine. Let's go ahead and get the coal over here. And we need a bridge across so that we can actually start this going. And a little bit of a, yeah, a warehouse. Just so they can start doing their thing. Let's go ahead and upgrade those. We'll get us a little bit of a stockpile. And I'm thinking right around here. I think we're going to do something eventually where we kind of close off an industrial district. So these are 15 seconds. These are 30. So it's one to two furnaces. And the sewing machines are also 30. So it's one furnace to one sewing machine. And let's take a look at it. How big they actually are. Uh, they're decent size. Ooh. Maybe something... All right, all right. I think I I think I know what we're looking at. Maybe that with a warehouse like that, and we'll mirror it on the other side. Yeah, and then we can just kind of put a road around it. Oh, it's actually a little bit off. It looks like our ceasefire with Annie. Ended. Now, I do want to make friends with her, so I'm going to go ahead and grab another ceasefire. Yeah, request a ceasefire. Yep, we'll take that. Let's see if we can offer her a, a little bit of a gift. Uh, try to give her a gift. Oh, yeah, pirates like the blooms. All right. I don't think that I can flatter her. Medium high. Yeah. Hi, I could probably offer another gift, but I'm going to go ahead and pass on that for now. I really want the guns she sells. 
No other reason, just guns. I don't think it's profitable. I know people that, you know, they trade out the actual uh, beer with her, which can be profitable. It's kind of like selling out the potatoes or with Eli or selling coal in the late game to Archibald. Uh, beer's even more profitable yet. That will take care, but this will take care of the need for sewing machines. What? Failed. Oh, I must not have actually got over there in time. I had better leave it to set. Yeah, it looks like we're going to produce two. We only need one, so that'll be good for a little while. Now, let's go ahead and grab our, our spare sp uh, spooners and get them sent over to old Archie. And we're going to go ahead and start selling those off. Now, let's get our, our actual fleet kind of parked over here. Now, with bricks, we were able to upgrade our warehouse. It looks like we can with our uh, with glass as well. Right now, we're at three loading per second. Let's see what this does. Hey, that moves us up to five. We'll work with that. We'll work with it. And it looks like we have enough actual artisans that we can go ahead and upgrade this row. Get glass coming in even faster. Good. I think what that allows us to do, still need more for the actual Docklands Wharf. And we need more for the, the pier. Now, I think the Docklands Wharf will actually be a little bit better and... Looks like we also need a little bit more money to make the actual public morning it's worthwhile. Which will start us getting visitors. We'll kind of put it over here because we're going to do Docklands over here. Speaking of that, let's go ahead and plop that. There we go. Now, for modules. I think an export office is going to be first. Just to kind of frame this in, we'll go ahead and move it up here. It's the getting started off the actual wharf that I'm not quite sure about. Maybe we'll do... I feel it reflects the times. Maybe a harbor master. And then we'll go with a depot. We'll kind of start bringing it out so that we can move into a pier at the actual end. Let me grab this paper real quick before it auto publishes. City becomes uglier. We'll take care of that. And mission follow up. Oh, uh, let's uh, go ahead and throw a propaganda there and throw a money there. And we'll go ahead and. Censorship is not always. The cranny of the corrupt. <laughs> Get our loading wharf, which should lead into the actual appear at the end. Yeah, we'll kind of do something like that. All of them like the fact that I, I did propaganda. And we get the, uh, the, the actual bonus from it now. Looks like we have enough glass that we can go ahead and upgrade our actual wharf. So let's take a look. You have amassed considerable forces, I must admit. He likes that we're building ships, which is good. Now, for anything useful, we could actually import the goulash if we export it enough. But what we should do is actually export something for wood. And what we might look at doing is exporting, setting a limit for probably sewing machines to bring in for wood. Because if we set this up here, oh yeah, we got to set it over here. And we plop wood over here. Yeah, 50 uh, sewing machines for 586. And by the time it's upgraded all the way, that's closer to 50 for over a thousand. Let's go ahead and set up a limit for how many sewing machines we'll allow traded out. I'm thinking 50. That way, when old Tobias comes, he can take some of those. We'll start getting the actual trade going on that. Let's go ahead and upgrade our warehouse. That way, we kind of keep going. Now, what's next on the agenda list? Fur, I think, requires... Yeah, this requires to go to the old world, unless we get lucky with an item over here. Yeah, Vex Carpentry. Let's get... 
let's get one of our our actual frigates over here just kind of parked so we can just periodically check them and let's go ahead and sell these uh, spooners off you'd slow my runaway train. yeah carl's not very happy let's go ahead and close those out come on sell Take the rudder. Ah, yes. there we go let's get one more sold off i think that's the last of our our unassigned little ships what a jolly, jolly. there we go now looking at what he has this looks like another frigate this looks like an actual clipper now, here is a vital matter oh the queen and country. i'm not ready for that what about this yeah that's a clipper let's go ahead and see if we can buy that boy, i was chased through the palace by a disgruntled goose honking and hissing i had its egg you see once i'd given it back the goose and I became firm friends. Now, chased by a goose as a boy. How does that relate to selling me a ship, my man? All right, now, let's get that. <laughs> and, and let's get this on one of the actual trade routes. I am, I am confused there. I'm thinking the sausage. Let's go ahead and replace that with a clipper. Let's go ahead and upgrade this to uh, the max. Just uber confused that's the moment there what does that have to do with it let's get our our sausages our over here and uh, unloaded let's get that back where it belongs and where is it looks like our frigate may have arrived Stations. all right we've got four hundred thousand. let's go ahead and spin to win a couple of times fex snaps distillery that could be good fex the church uh Prevents a hostile takeover. A cup of coffee. You've been playing for two hours. Oh, this is what I get for leaving my uh, my my game up. I get little prompts. And let's see. Fex potato farms. And hop farms. We get snops for free. Not ready to buy that, but I really want it. Yeah, not too useful there. I'm really looking for an actor. Or let's take a look. It's a uh, something that is used in the cannery. Oh, we gotta set it to unknown. Chef um, Michael, instead of goulash, the building process is pig, and I'm pretty sure we can get that through. Yeah, we can get that through Eli. He's gonna cost a pretty penny though. We'll probably have to keep uh, probably two, three hundred thousand just to get that. Fex the light bulb factory, something we'll use soon. We'll go ahead and call that. We'll just, as I said, we'll just kind of leave a frigate here so we can go over and pop over and check those occasionally. Now we do have the quest for the cape, but we don't want to do that yet. We also have the quest for the land alliance. And there's our expedition for the new world. I think we should go ahead and set up one of our ship of the lines for that. And to do that, I'm thinking we need something from over here. Ah, yes. the bright young sapling. So a self-repair would get us a crafting. I think we want something. We'll wait until it's over here, but something like a, a scope in order to give us some hunting. So, all right. Let's take a look at our production and see how it's doing globally now that we've done a big expansion. Looks like Snops is actually starting to level now that we're moving around some people. It looks like Close is actually over now, which is good. So that way we shouldn't have to actually build more. We should actually, speaking of Close, let's do this. Our Close route, let's go ahead and put our next two clippers here. And let's go ahead and delete these off. And we'll go ahead and bring the actual Close all the way around. That looks good, and we're going to go ahead and start proactively sending it over to this island as well. So that we can just have those clothes there and ready to go. Let's go ahead and upgrade that. Now, for this route right here, do we have another clipper? Yeah, here's a clipper. Let's do this. 
Let's go ahead and grab this island in here, grab that island, and over on Charlevoix, let's go ahead and load up glass. We'll have to set up some limits and uh, drop it off. Yeah, not ready for that. And let's do the same here. Let's go ahead and unload. That way this kind of circulates to all the different islands. All right, let's go ahead and get that on its route. And let's go over here and go ahead and set this up to, I don't know, say 100. That should keep enough in this area to keep it going. Now we can probably grab this next row here. <laughs> yes, they have time to work, that's for sure. We will work them hard. We will get all the money we can. Let's go ahead and clear that out. And it looks like this spooner is ready to actually drop off. Man, it's having a hard time even keeping up with that. Come on up, guys. Come on up. All right, we can drop all of those. And we can drop all of these. We can get these two actually sent down to Archibald to get them sold out. On our way. This has clothes in it. We better actually unload those clothes first. Yeah, we're not crucial there, but looking at it, looks like bread's starting to get low and beer is definitely low. That's probably why we're not making a lot of money. All right, down here you go. Oh, and it just rotated. Now the repair crane gives me 30 crafting. Go ahead and roll it once. Now this only affects steam engines, so I can't use it. Affects pubs and variety theaters. Just gives us crafting of 20. Let's see if we can roll for an actual blue one. Yeah, we'll take this, the self-repairing. Let's go ahead and trade that over with our actual chip of the line. Oh, that's for the harbor. That's fine. We can still, we'll, we'll still use it. And then let's go over to Eli and see if we can get an admiral. Clean record. Affects mines. Ooh. All right. All right. Destruction quest and gives me a gunman. That's exactly what we're looking for. And it's only for a frigate, so let's go ahead and grab our actual frigates. Steady her course. And get those taken care of. Now, looks like it's kind of coming through this area into the fog of war, so we'll probably have to watch it. There it goes. Come on, guys. Go take them out. Now, are these ready to bring up? They are. Let's go ahead and grab our our pier over here, and let's go ahead and get our loading wharf. What does that bring this to? 4.5. No. Ship, Ship should start actually uh, going over there. And it looks like we've almost caught up to them. I don't like it that the NPC ships don't actually slow down when they take damage, where if it was shooting mine, it would be slowing down. There we go. I only need one of you guys to go pick these up. Gives me three castaways. I only need to turn in one. All right. Go drop off and let's go check the paper. Rival war breaks out and ship sold. Yeah, we'll take that. I think we have some more ships to sell. No, uh, we're not ready for that yet. Come on, sell. Station. Your people are rioting. What? Oh yeah, I think we need a police department over here. Eh, under the workers, we'll just kind of we'll pin it right there. That should take care of that need. We could probably actually... Injury to one is injury to... Looks like their their biggest 
peeve is the fact that they don't have beer. Now, I do have three fields. Let's go four, five, and six, and let's go ahead and get these upgraded. Now, we're probably going to have to upgrade, yep, turn in our quest before we uh, get that and get our gunsmith. Now, we're probably going to have to actually upgrade this area quite a bit. Taking a look at it. Yeah, we, we need at least one more. Need at least one more to actually make this work. Let's actually see if we can fit this in. I think we want a road in here. Road in there. Let's get a, a road actually going down. Go ahead and bring this one over. We'll leave a spot for a road. Now... I have a feeling we want our actual something about like this. Put this one in the corner. Get him over there. The strike has ended. Well, it's good that the strike ended. I don't think we need the beer for this. I think that's a little closer. Let's go ahead and get another brewery here. And I think we want... A competitor raised a settlement. Something about... Something about like this. Now, let's see where they actually did that. Oh, just a little tiny island by the Admiral there. That's fine. I feel like we're close here. Well, we'll leave it for now, because it will at least get it while I kind of think of what I'm doing with my design. Yeah, that, that will at least get me my beer that I need. Maybe I need to go one more out. But, as long as we're actually taking care of our demand, that will bring us up to six. Yeah, as long as we're taking care of that, I'm okay with it for now. Because we're going to end up reworking this all in the future anyways. Because probably in the next episode, we'll be into Engineers, which will bring us into Bright Harvest. Let's go ahead and clear this out. See if that actually brings us enough money to make us back into the positive. I don't think we're missing anything else over here. I need something to blunt my rage on. Beer and bread. All right. Go back over here and see what we're, we've got going on. Alright, we need one more. Let's go ahead and get both of these. Now, we probably need, over on our main island, we probably need at least one more windmill. So let's go ahead and plop that. And go ahead and see if that brings us up to eight. Yeah, it'll bring us up to eight. So we should be okay for overall. Let's double check our wheat just to make sure. Let's go to all islands. And our demand for wheat is still a little bit higher. All right. We're going to have to snag some quick farms in just to maintain. Now, at some point in time, yeah, probably the next episode, we'll rework this whole island as we get into tractors. Let's kind of do something real quick right here. Eh, let's grab... Hey, <laughs> not the road. Something about, like... This. I just want to stay with this whole theme that it, it kind of looks like it's a little bit natural. You know, we're still in that age of farmers, so this is a, a farm. To me, it's a farmer's house. And they're just kind of in the middle of their fields, is my image. Yeah, snag the rest of these in here. That's good. Uh, yep. Let's go ahead and upgrade all of those. Let's go ahead and get our actual warehouse built. Let's see what we can do with this. Now, over the, the course of probably the next couple episodes, we're probably going to fill in this whole area. I just have a feeling of that. We're just going to kind of fill in with the same theme where we just do try to do a warehouse with like four farms around it. Go ahead and get that one built, and then we can do something like bring this around over to the corner. Has ended. That'll work, because our next one we can fill in that last little bit. 
Now, did that bring it up high enough that we're over the global demand? One more farm. Uh, I, I don't like putting five off of here because it cost considerably more to go up. So this one's 50. I think the next one's actually like 100 and some, but we'll go ahead and bite the bullet this time. And just something. I guess we have to start on this side. It makes sense. All right, move down there so we can finish it. Excellent. So that should put us back positive. Might want to put two more at some point in time so we can make another bakery. But that should get our money back under control. As we get beer and everything going. Let's get a couple more clippers going. And let's see if we can upgrade this next batch. We're missing bread. Okay, so we have to wait for that to come over to actually do the upgrade. That's fine, that's fine. We have glass now, so let's go ahead and... Grass is greener on the other side. Get that one. I don't want to do the cannery without the actual specialist. See if we can just kind of take a random roll. Yeah, still nothing. I really want that. I guess we're going to have to uh, break down and go ahead and get the, the cannery going. Close out all of our notifications. More than ready. Now, here is a vital matter of queen and country. Yeah, we're not ready for the queen yet, but we can Shut probably up, send see. him over to a harbor so we can start getting him loaded up for for the expedition to the new land. I think that might be a good decision to get that going. Because rum is quite a bit of money. Now, our actual ship, we'll send him over to... Well, he's already here. Because we'll end up sending this hull with the actual... Uh, with the ship of the line. Ah, uh, there we go. Let's go ahead and take a look at our route. This one's pretty well set. I think the bread... I don't think we're producing enough to need more. Sausage, I think we already, yeah, we already upgraded that. Soap. Here's something. Oh, we already upgraded that, too. We'll do soap next. Go ahead and plop that in there. And we'll go ahead and cue it here as well. Let's go ahead and start unloading that. Yeah, that's good. So what does it take for the actual artisan kitchen? So cattle is two minutes. Peppers is two minutes. The kitchen is two minutes. The cannery is a minute and a half. So we'd have to go four cattle ranches to three canneries. And it looks like an iron mine can supply six. So we're going to have to place the the farms over on the other island. You guys, you're still missing bread. Do you have beer finally? You do not have beer. Do we have a problem with our beer, beer line here? We're not up to the minimum stock yet. Well, we have plenty of actual... Farms. Hmm. Where are we having a little bit of a, a lack here? Look, busy people. Maybe need to upgrade the warehouse. We're taking every I think that's under agricultural. Yeah, we don't have any extra hops right now. Let's get one more just to see if 
like we're having an issue with tops. Looks like malt we have. Missing three fields. Are we missing other fields on there? Now, hmm. here is a vital matter for Queen and Country. I'm a little bit confused there. Well, it should be up and going. I don't think we're at our actual max for beer. Yeah, we're not up for our max. But yet, these guys are not actually producing. Yeah, missing hops. I am uber confused as to why they're missing hops. Let's go ahead and upgrade these roads, and let's go ahead and upgrade this warehouse, just to make sure it's not a warehouse problem. Still, on the hops, don't have any in the actual storehouse. Oh, we're missing. We, I get what we're doing. Ceasefire has ended. I need these hops to up and going. That's why we have the issue. You might just be the best of a All right, let's go ahead and bankrupt. Let's go ahead and edit this and go ahead and throw one of those up there. Let's go ahead and publish that. Yeah, that took care of the money for the moment. And as for our ship of the line. Let's go ahead and get this over. Oh, we can probably bring him actually over here. New orders. There we go. And now we can get him on that expedition to the new world. I'll steer ye from here to the precipice, the edge of the world. Yep, this one right here. It looks like we have almost everything that we need. Navigation would be good and hunting would be good. And we'll get some rations in there. Uh, I think the best thing for rations would probably be... Well, glass for hunting. Let's take 10 glass for the hunting. Now, here is a vital matter for Queen. And for the actual ration, we probably need to bring some food. Let's bring some, some actual sausage with them. So we're missing navigation. We I was hoping we'd get it through a, a specialty person. Let's make sure we don't have anything in here. Nah. But it, it says that we're 100% morale. So we're probably good to go. So let's go ahead and get him sent off. And uh, don't stop there. Be cruel if you have to. Be cruel if you have to. <laughs> I like that. I, I like the fact that he's like, be cruel. All right, let's get these sold. Jolly, jolly. So that they're no longer on the budget list. Let's go ahead and send th these guys down here. Adjust the sail. And let's check. Heh. <laughs> There's our navigation and our fleet our actual uh, fleet power. Let's get that unloaded. Now let's take a look. So it's damage to ships. Uh, and I think our other one is... No, we didn't leave one over at Eli. Let's get him over to Eli. Yeah, still garbage over here. I don't want to spin it until we're actually there. And the captain's uh, rearing. <laughs> Willie's happy. Alright, let's sell the next one of these. Sell that one. And for this, we actually got to sell these guys off. Then we should be good to go with ships. Because from now on, we're just going to use clippers until we get to steamships. That's much better. Now, once glass gets divvied around to all the islands, we can start upgrading the harbors, which will make trade even go quicker. Things are somewhat... Let's get the Variety Theater, because that's some extra coins. I think that will go a long way. We could probably plop it. My guess would be right here.
Yeah, it, it's gonna be that way. Work, sleep, and rest. Ceasefire has ended. Uh, there's the ceasefire with Anne. Let's go ahead and slow down time just a little bit. Will we go ahead and renew? Yep, we'll take that. Looks like our fleet power is finally starting to catch up. Talking about fleet power. Wow, he's got a lot of fleet power. And the Admiral is out of this world. Yep, we got to get more ships down. Let's get the, the Variety Theater. Get that upgraded because that will get us some coins. Seven coins per. It only costs 100, so I mean, we've got... By the time we hit about... 15 houses, which two blocks is 18. That's actually a positive, so that's pretty much a win-win there. Alright, but I think this is a good spot to go ahead and call this episode. So in the next episode, we'll be pretty much starting right out in the new land. So we can get our, our actual... Uh, we can get our fur coats, and then we'll try to loop back and get canned food and come across to happiness and get rum. So I'd like to thank you guys for uh, joining. If you like what you saw, slam that like and subscribe button, and we'll see you in the next episode.